in theory, a man can just ghost a wife. He can just stop coming over. He can stop paying any kind of support towards her household. She, he's, no, he's not legally obligated and she can make no legal claim on him. She should have a claim on him financially. They've been married, they've had children together. Maybe there's child support, maybe there's alimony, maybe there's, I don't know. I feel like it would be healthier all the way around if the women... Welcome. I well, never said my kids weren't welcome. If they apologize and they're kind of No, like, no, no, I completely reversed that. I said, all we've got to do is be able to have a conversation so we're not sitting here in our house like a bunch of alcoholics that had a fight last night and forgot it happened. Everybody is? Yeah, not Maddie and Kayla, but everybody else is. Everybody is coming. So and I'm just finding this out. You I said, think, last you know, time we talked, you said they can't come till they apologize. Listen, you need, and I need to communicate some more. because That's what you said. You've said that to me multiple times. They need to apologize. Never easier to say. Oh, and I have to keep working because it's what I understand. It's what I know. It's what I know I need to do. And for me, working some of the time means posting on social media. And those of you that have understood that it's just what I have to to keep moving forward, thank you. In the recent episodes of Sister Wives, Cody Brown's tree chopping scenes sparked discussions among fans regarding their symbolic significance. Initially seen as expressions of anger, it's now interpreted as having deeper meanings, especially with Robin Brown's comment about the trees being angry with Cody. The symbolism of trees in the Brown family's life is explored, from family commitments to Christine's wedding. Some fans believe Cody's actions represent severing his connections with the family, while others connect it to Mary's desires regarding trees throughout the series. In the wake of Garrison Brown's passing, the Brown family continues to navigate their grief. Christine Brown and her daughter Truly are finding support from David Woolley, Christine's husband. As they mourn Garrison's loss, David's presence proves invaluable in helping Truly cope with her emotions, reflecting a unique bond between stepfather and stepdaughter. Janelle Brown's acceptance of Garrison's folded flag marked a poignant moment, with the Nevada National Guard honoring his memory. The funeral saw the family coming together in remembrance, with Cody and Robin among those paying tribute, possibly through a tire echoing Garrison's clothing business. Amidst their mourning, the family faces further challenges, as seen in a visit from the Flagstaff care team, reflecting the ongoing impact of Garrison's loss on the entire family. Welcome to a creative night shows, where the drama unfolds and the stories captivate. Join us as we delve into the intriguing world of a sister wives, revealing the untold tales and hidden truths behind the headlines. Is there any truth to Cody Brown's tree chopping scenes in the last episodes? The reason for Cody Brown's tree cutting has come to light since Sister Wives season 18 premiered. Although some saw Cody's gesture as a way to express his anger, it now appears to have deeper symbolic meaning. Cody Brown's Significative Behaviors Robin Brown remarks during the wedding special that she feels like the tree is angry with Cody Brown for his inability to bring it down. All these trees are mad at me, he replies. Their desire was to survive. Fans of Sister Wives initiated a debate on Reddit on Cody Brown's habit of felling trees in the last episodes of season 18. A fan notices a strange similarity. They begin by referring to the concept as irony symbolic whatever. Next, include a thought-provoking statement regarding the action's significance. Does anyone else think it's amusing that Cody says he wants to do something dramatic, like cut down a tree, in the first episode? Then, during Christine's wedding in the last episode, he is once more acting dramatic by down a tree. Nevertheless, they have always represented their family with a tree. They had a tree-shaped cake for the family commitment ceremony. The world is actually telling us that Cody should cut down the tree just as he did his family. Because of his vanity and craving for approval and attention, he carelessly dropped it on the ground. Others discuss the real reasons for the chopping. Moreover, some Sister Wives viewers connect the chopping down of trees to additional meaning that Cody Brown reveals. Wow, this statement is really smart. Until you mentioned it here, I had never even considered the significance associated with trees. 
Mary's wish to not be in the trees, during their initial move to Flagstaff and her ambivalence over her desire to be in the trees during the division of the Coyote Pass lots could be included, I suppose. Well, sometimes I'm sitting here with a big, duh, look on my face and people just get it on a whole other level. This is such a great perspective, and seeing it and putting it together that way is just incredible. I never would have considered this. Indeed. Furthermore, didn't Mary paint portraits of all the grown-ups, with branches and trees standing in for the number of children each wife had? And further witness attests, yes, she did. Each wife's tree artwork is unique. Throughout the entire series, Cody Brown has a deep sense of symbolism. A other sister wives watcher saw numerous instances where the family tree was used again a number of which Cody Brown considers to be their life's connection. This series has a lot of tree symbolism. In the first episode, they accidentally foreshadowed the impending disaster by cutting down a tree. 2. Janelle receives a necklace with a tree pendant from Cody. 3. At the dedication ceremony, a tree is planted, and every child receives mementos adorned with the crests of their tree families. The obscenely costly cake is fashioned like a tree. 4. In an episode, Mary works to remove trees from the B&B, symbolizing her journey of letting go of the past. 5. Throughout the past several seasons, Cody has chopped down numerous trees, demonstrating how his actions are severing his relationship with the family. However, the family happily celebrates Christine's wedding without him while he is away doing so. This symbology nearly seems to have been pre-planned. Do you believe Cody Brown was trying to make a point? Do you believe it was only ironic that he talked about how his family trees represented him yet was so willing to chop some down? Are you anticipating more episodes of Sister Wives? Please leave a remark below. Aiding Truly Brown in handling Garrison's demise is David Woolley. Unquestionably, everyone is grieving over Sister Wives Garrison Brown's passing. But for now, the Brown family is dealing with the worst nightmare of losing a brother, uncle, and son. Even if three weeks have passed, a devastating loss never goes away. Rather, the family finds fresh methods to navigate the road without Garrison every morning when they wake up. Although Christine Brown has disclosed the coping strategies she used to come back to life, her husband David Woolley is now providing support to Truly Brown. Christine and Truly Brown require assistance. Grief undoubtedly manifests itself differently in each person. Christine Brown, notably, is returning to the business as usual, in numerous aspects. Even though her heart is broken, she longs for the consistency that her regular life provides. Despite not being Garrison Brown's real mother, she was instrumental in assisting Janelle Brown, Cody Brown, and the other sister wives in raising him. However, saying goodbye to a loved one doesn't make life simple. Time flies by, and Christine is still a wife and mother. Notably, her 13-year-old daughter Truly Brown still resides at home. Certainly, processing intense feelings after a sibling dies can be significantly more challenging for an adolescent. It is admirable that David Woolley is giving Christine and Truly the much-needed support they require during this difficult time in their life. Amid the family's grief, David Woolley works hard with Truly Brown. Even though the couple is still in their honeymoon phase, the loss of Garrison Brown has affected the whole Brown family. Christine Brown, star of Sister Wives, shares some adorable pictures of David Woolley working really hard to support Truly Brown on her Instagram page. The two are investigating the natural healing properties of nature with a carousel of images. Found some amazing petroglyphs only an hour or so out of our way, writes Christine in the caption. To be honest, I would make the extra effort to watch Valia fire it again. Was. Fantastic. Petroglyphs in the outdoors, away from the main trail in Valley of Fire. Then, viewers can witness David and truly bravely scaling the petroglyphs. 
Valley of Fire is where they are situated. True Brown and David Woolley have a unique bond. As stepfather and stepdaughter, David Woolley and Truly Brown appear to share a unique bond. Living with a man full-time has undoubtedly changed Truly and Christine Brown's lives significantly. Christine does notice, though, that they are mutually understanding. She has previously stated, I believe that was the decisive factor for me. Once, he approached Truly and struck up a conversation before sitting down to get to know her. He was aware of her. That relationship will be crucial as Truly learns to deal with difficult feelings that no adolescent should ever have to deal with. However, she has an excellent network of support available to her. She has many siblings and two birth parents to help guide her through the process. However, she is even more fortunate to have an additional stepfather in her life. David will grieve Garrison differently, and having gone through tremendous grief after the loss of his first wife, he may have more capacity to support her in this regard. How do you feel about the efforts made by David Woolley to assist Truly and Christine Brown at this point? Do you believe he'll be able to support them as they grieve? Please share your thoughts in the section below. First photos, Janelle Brown, in tears, receives the folded flag from the garrison. In a ceremony on Tuesday, Sister Wives star Janelle Brown accepted her son Garrison's folded flag. There wasn't a dry eye in the house when the Brown family got together for the occasion. See the devastating images and the statement from the Nevada National Guard by watching on. With tears in her eyes, Janelle Brown accepts Garrison's folded flag. The Nevada National Guard has made public the first images from the folded flag ceremony, which feature Janelle Brown accepting Garrison's flag. Hunter Brown was seated next her, and the sister wives' family was all around her. The Nevada National Guard Facebook page posted a touching message about Garrison Brown along with photos from the ceremony. The post said, Today, at the Clark County Armory, soldiers from the 1st Squadron, 221st Cavalry, joined with friends and family to honor the memory of Staff Sergeant Robert Garrison Brown, who passed away on March 4. Garrison was described as a, a beloved son, brother, uncle, and friend by them. The statement went on, Brown, who was well known for his spirit of adventure, traveled widely and saw many different nations and continents. He was passionate about humor, do-it-yourself projects, and daring photography, his images of the night sky really moved viewers. Officials from the Nevada National Guard also praised Garrison Brown's service and his future goals. The Facebook post said, As a proud CAV scout and staff sergeant in the Army National Guard, Brown exemplified dedication to his country. He also had a compassionate nature and wanted to help people by becoming a nurse. The message said, His memory serves as a reminder to cherish loved ones and prioritize compassion. They included information on counseling services available for fellow Guard members at the end of the post. Supporters offer their warmest regards to the Brown family. Many people expressed their sympathies and well wishes for the Brown family in the comment area. Peace be with you, Garrison. I'm so sad for your loss, commented a user. Another complimented the guard for paying such a lovely tribute to his memory. There has been a significant loss. Everything we feel is for the family. My deepest sympathies to the Brown family, said a third. Without a question, the loss of Garrison Brown has completely shocked Janelle Brown and the other sister wives members. In the front row, seated next to Cody, are photos of a visibly moved Robin Brown. David Woolley and Christine Brown were also there. When the folded flag of her late son was given to Janelle, Christine appeared to be fighting back tears. Mary Brown sat down opposite the other members of the household. Several of Garrison's siblings were also present, and they were clearly moved by the event. Garrison Brown died on March 4 from a gunshot wound he self-inflicted. Sister Wives, Robin is consoled by Cody during Garrison's funeral. 
stars of the TLC series Sister Wives, Cody Brown and Robin Brown, along with the rest of the family, attended Garrison Brown's funeral. The 25-year-old, who passed away at the start of this month, is beautifully remembered in the funeral photos as well. Cody Brown and Robin Brown, Sister Wives, Front Row the National Guard presented Janelle Brown with the folded American flag as a memento of Garrison. On one of the images shared today, Cody Brown and Robin Brown were seated on the first row, a little distance away from Janelle. David Woolley and his wife, Christine Woolley Brown, were seated next to Robin and the patriarch of Sister Wives. The picture on top shows the parents encircled by their children. However, you may have observed something else in the family. They took action in remembrance of Garrison. Robin participated, but did Cody? Garrison operated a clothes business. Every piece of apparel had a floral print on it. At one point, he served a large number of family members as clients. Even Garrison's website uses the image below, with him at the grill with Cody and Gabriel Brown, as one of his Bob's Floral Shirts promotional images. Many family members attended Garrison's burial wearing flowered shirts and other mementos as a tribute to him. There appear to be a lot of floral ties in the picture. The photo that was shot at the funeral also has Robin dressed in flowers. If this is one of the designs that Garrison sold, it is unknown. However, it is unquestionably consistent with the tribute. Though it's difficult to see, it appears that Cody Brown is wearing a flowered shirt underneath his jacket. Sister Wives, When Families Unite It appears like all of the Sister Wives family's disagreements were set aside in order to commemorate Garrison Brown. His siblings made remarks about how delighted he would have been to see them all together once more. Many admirers who commented on the funeral photos mentioned Gabe Brown. The police reports described how horrified he was to see his sibling dead. The police report stated at one point that Gabriel Brown left with a member of the sister wife's household to pick up his father the morning he discovered his brother. It was his responsibility to return him to his brother's home. However, the article claimed Gabe came back by himself. Cody and Robin's visit at home a few days later, according to a different report, Cody and Robin's home was visited by the Flagstaff Care Team. This division of first responders responds to certain calls. The care team is deployed when responding to a 911 call is most appropriate for mental health specialists. An EMT and a mental health specialist make up the team. Nothing further has ever come to light regarding the team's outing thus it is unknown who they saw. All of the family members were affected negatively by the loss of their son, brother, and uncle. In their most recent posts, a few of the grown sister wives' kids made reference to this. With their TLC series, this family has been a fixture on television for more than 10 years. Thus, a large number of their followers posted their condolences. Return here to get the most recent information about Sister Wives. For more of the latest updates and behind-the-scenes secrets from Sister Wives, make sure to hit subscribe and ring that bell. Stay in the know with every new release.